What's good again, the Hoodie Pay Gang? It's your boy Jay, aka Paper Jay's, and I'm back with another freaking video. Who came up this year? So if you couldn't tell from today's title, I am back with another reaction video. I haven't done a reaction video in like a month or two. I'm going to be reacting to some old outfits. I saw a few people do this. Denzel, Dion, and I think her channel was Monet. I'm going to put it on the screen, but you should go definitely go check out their videos. I definitely need to do this video because I feel like my style has changed drastically since I entered high school. And it's, it's really changed since my junior year. I'm a junior now. Well... Technically, I'm a senior because school is out for the rest of the year, so, you know, call me senior. My style has changed so much since junior year. I'm wearing more prints. Um, I'm not so much into, like, Jordans. I'm more into designer shoes. I like to accessorize. I like different jackets. Like, it's just so many more things that I do opposed to just throwing on a shirt, some jeans, and some shoes. I usually like to really put together an outfit so I know that when I walk into a building, I'm finna get some compliments. When I walk into a building, everybody finna be looking, who? At me. I'm not even gonna talk much longer because I'm ready to get into this video. I know my outfits used to be atrocious. Ooh. A lot of these outfits are from middle school and freshman year. So yeah, I'm not gonna talk much longer. Make sure you like this video, subscribe to my channel, and let's get into this video. The first picture I took, this was actually back in my old neighborhood. I used to live in Virginia Beach, aka the best time ever school-wise. Go Lions. Right here, I got on this floral looking, you know back then, fellas, y'all know, back then it was like the curved shirt style. That was like the style back then, but I had a floral shirt on with like the N.A. I guess I was trying to copy off of I think Chanel. Um, I never even read the shirt before. O-S-T-R-K-T, whatever that means. Some blue straight leg looking pants and my maroon sixes. I used to love this shirt and I used to love these shoes. Like the way I used to dress back then, I used to put so much effort into my clothes, but in reality, they really weren't all that. They were actually kind of bad. I'm not even gonna lie. They were really, really bad. Like this is, this is childish looking. I just can't get over the fact that like, it just curves. And I used to love a good curved shirt, but that's just not the style anymore. So next up, this was actually the day after Christmas because I know this for a fact because we went to the mall and I, I was like, I'm gonna pull out my new stuff. Like, I'm just gonna be lit. So as you can see, I used to be pretty basic. I was a pretty basic dresser. Like I said, I used to just wear a plain shirt, some jeans, and some Jordans. Jordans was all I used to wear. So I have on a white v-neck shirt, some ripped jeans that I got from Manhattan, AKA used to be my favorite store literally i used to shop there for all my clothes like manhattan back then it's my asos now so i had on a white v-neck shirt some ripped jeans from manhattan and my maroon sixes and as you can see i have a manhattan bag in my hand because like i said i used to love manhattan this is something i would wear probably to like the grocery store not even gonna lie like i throw stuff on like this to go to like the grocery store or if i'm just like going to a friend's house but if i'm stepping out like going somewhere where people are actually gonna see me well scratch that people who are actually gonna pay attention to me then i'm gonna make sure to look my best but going to the mall with this on nah it's a no for me number two or no this is actually outfit number three. So outfit number three, I actually took this in North Carolina either late November or early December. But as you can see, back at it again with a plain basic shirt. So I'm wearing a black long sleeve shirt that's rolled up um, in cuffs on the side. I have on some jeans or some joggers actually from Manhattan, which actually cuff at the bottom. And I have some 11s on. 11s are still my favorite shoe, but this outfit is still really basic. Black on khaki on black. First of all, I don't even wear khaki. Khaki is disgusting. The only khaki I probably own in my wardrobe right now are my corduroy pants. I don't even count those as khaki. Those are like uh, brown. This right here is ugly. I wouldn't dare step foot out the house in this. And I was looking at the other pictures with this, like the pants on. The pants are just so baggy. And I'm not talking about like the stylish baggy. Like third grade baggy. That's the type of baggy it was. I don't like that. This was actually in seventh grade. Um, nobody was home so I had my grandma take my picture. This whole day was just crazy. I still remember it. I'm wearing this black plain shirt with like leather on it I believe which is probably from H&M. Um, some joggers which are probably from I don't know H&M or what's the other store? Manhattan. And again I'm wearing some Jordans. I, like I said I should be like just a plain guy. I would just wear a shirt, some joggers, in Jordans. Back then, joggers were actually really stylish. I would never probably wear joggers unless it's the joggers that don't cuff at the bottom. Like, if they cuff at the bottom, you won't catch me in those. 
Next up, I was actually outside of my band room. I was in band when I was in middle school for like a year. I played the drums, it was stupid. I'm wearing some chinos and I hate, hate chinos with a passion. I cannot stand wearing chinos, the way they feel, the way they look, the way they just spit on you, disgusting. I can't stand chinos and they're, Mm -mm. But I'm wearing some chinos with a Michael Jordan shirt from Manhattan. I don't even know where this jacket is from. I think it's from like TJ Maxx or something like that. And again, the same shoes, the Jordans. I don't know. I still wouldn't wear this. It's like, I don't know what was going through my head. I kind of was just, I was a, I was really mitchy matchy. I can say that. I used to be very, very mitchy matchy when it came to like clothes. Everything had to match. So if I'm wearing gray and black, like a gray and black jacket, I'm going to wear gray pants and I'm going to wear black shoes. I don't like that. Like, I, I really don't like mitchy matching too much that's not my style okay so next up i'm so glad i'm out this phase <laughs> i'm actually wearing the same black and gray jacket with a white v-neck these look like aztec like aztec joggers that are from h&m aztec denim joggers actually and some tims with the tongue that's kind of messed up um yeah this is definitely a no for me i look like i got dressed in the dark number one i don't even know why i have i had tims i hate tims i cannot stand Tims. I don't know if it's because I can't pull them off, but I can pull them off. I just don't like Tims. Like, they're just so bulky. They're not like a, a nice bulky like Doc Martens are. They're just like an ugly, clunky bulky. I can't stand Tims. And I used to always get a pair of Tims every school year before the year started. Looking back, I'm like, why? Why would you just, why would you do that? I look like I got dressed in the dark. Poses are ugly. Pants, they really just mess everything up. And I remember, I used to have the same girl take my pictures. I don't know if you're watching this, Angel, but I remember you. And you used to take my pictures all the time. You're a real one. Oh, all right, so who took my pictures this day? Again, I'm wearing, I actually have on a cheap necklace from Manhattan, of course. I used to get cheap necklaces from there all the time. This jacket actually isn't mine though. Um, this was actually a girl named Reyes jacket. I loved this jacket. It was just so warm. And from here on out, I've always wanted a Nike jacket and I actually got one not too long ago, so. Praise the Lord. I'm wearing um, the Nike jacket, a chain, the same jeans that I had on before in Tim's. Like I said, you know, I used to be a little bit matchy. I didn't have on a shirt under this. So I guarantee you I didn't have a shirt under this. No, to each his own. Well, not really to each his own because this each was my own, but y'all understand what I'm trying to say. My style, ha I, as you can see so far, I'm not even through all the pictures and you can tell that my style has changed tremendously. You won't ever catch me stepping out the house looking like this. That's first of all, that's mm -mm. If I come stepping out like this, ask me what's wrong with me. I'm so serious too, ask me what's wrong with me. And I just realized my hair was dyed. Man, these was the good old days. All right, so back at it again with matching down from the head to the toe. So same ugly jacket. I threw this away, I don't know how many years ago, but I ended up throwing it away because it was just really ugly. Black and gray jacket with a black shirt, some moto jeans actually. I think these have like the American, <laughs> they're black moto jeans with rips on them and they have the American flag printed on them in gray. You, I don't think you can really tell, but I remember these pants because I ended up cutting them and making them into shorts. And I actually have on the same, these were kind of like my favorite shoes. Like when I would get 11s for Christmas, I would wear them out low key until the bottoms of them turn yellow. And this is what I'm talking about. I used to be so basic. I used to do everything just matchy, 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 matchy. And I don't know what well, I do know what. I was young and I thought I was killing it, but I really wasn't killing it. Mm, okay, so this actually got, spring back memories. This is actually taken backstage at my mom's concert that she had like a concert out here it was a, a few years ago obviously because this was this was seventh grade i know for a fact so the scarf isn't even mine but i have on a louis vuitton scarf this shirt from h&m with leather on the side i have on some camo leather camo leather pants from manhattan i had like these leather pants in every single color and the same black jordans i feel like i'm gonna keep seeing these jordans because I, like i said i used to wear these a lot it's really not that bad if you ask me like i probably would tweak it if i were to wear it now but it's really not that bad well i don't know it kind of is that bad I don't know, it's kind of like 50-50. No, it's bad. It really is that bad. I'm not even gonna sit here and try to get it. It's, it's bad. Okay, so this, I used to love to do this all the time. I would wear Adidas with Jordans. 
I don't like to mismatch my brands all the time. Let me hurry up because my camera is dying. Ugh. I don't like to mismatch my brands all the time. It's just like kind of like a pet peeve of mine. I always used to wear Jordans with Adidas pants. I really don't know why, but I used to do it all the time. But I'm wearing this white shirt and my Citrus 11s. Oh, I wish I didn't sell my Citrus 11s. I really do because those were lit. All right, so this is actually eighth grade when I was downstairs in my old room. This actually isn't even bad. I'm not even gonna cap. The pants just get me. I probably wouldn't wear the pants with this. I probably would do like another type of pant. A pant and shirt. Everything else is cool. The belt, the jacket. It, the shoes. This actually isn't that bad. Okay, look at me uh, progressing just a little bit. At least I'm progressing through like the years because in eighth grade I did step it up just a little bit. When I say a little bit, I mean like a little bit, but I did step it up. For my birthday, this is my birthday there. I ain't even, I'm not mad at this outfit now. I'm not mad at this outfit. I'm digging it. The pants um, from H&M, Moto Pants, I actually still have those. Oh, I should probably wear those. Even though I really don't like Moto Pants, but I think, you know, I'm going to wear those because why not? But um, I'm wearing some moto pants. I don't even know what kind of shoes these are, but these are Jordan 12s. Jim Red Jordan 12s. And a shirt from Manhattan and a chain. This outfit took me like hours to pick out. And when I say hours, I mean hours to pick out. I'm not even mad at this outfit. I'm really not. I'm mad that I can't find the shirt because the shirt is actually tough. But I'm not mad at this outfit at all. I'm definitely not mad at this outfit. This outfit I would wear now. This outfit I would see. This is what I'm talking about. I stepped my game up just a little bit. This is my actual birthday. The photo before this was my birthday dinner. This is my actual birthday. So I got the shirt again from Manhattan. Black jeans from... What's it called? Um, H&M and just some all-star ones, I believe. All-star ones, my all-time favorite ones. I love my all-star ones and I really want a new pair so they seem crisp and whatnot. But this outfit right here, I ain't even mad at it. I like this outfit a lot. This next outfit, I actually just got a haircut and I got a new pair of shoes. What I used to do back in eighth grade is every time I got a new pair of shoes, because I used to get some all the time, I would wait until I had a haircut so I could take pictures. Um, I got the royal blues on, I believe, with some denim jeans, a Gucci belt, and um, a blue shirt, which I'm not mad at. I'm not mad at this outfit at all. So next up, we actually have pretty much the same outfit as what I wore for my birthday, but just a different shirt. I ain't even mad at this one either. I'd probably wear this out to the grocery store or something. Something slight, something slight. Or if like I'm doing like a bummy day at school, I don't, I really wear sweats my bummy day at school it's a pair of jeans a random shirt so this will probably be like a bummy day which will probably be soon no it won't be soon because school is <laughs> shut down <laughs> next outfit and last but certainly not least, let me hurry this up because this light is blanking. I have the same shirt on I had before, but I'm a little bit more matchy this time, which I hate. I have on a floral shirt that's had green, that has green in it. I decided to match it with some green motor pants and my maroon sixes, which are mad dirty and didn't fit. I remember trying to squeezing my foot in these shoes just so I can wear them. Sad, right? I know. I definitely don't like this outfit. I hate matchy matchy stuff. Matchy matchy stuff is disgusting. I can't stand it. Don't like it. So pretty soon, I don't know, but my I'm getting clippers because I'm not sure if you guys know. But um, schools are shutting down in Virginia for the rest of the academic school year. Nest balls are shutting down, so can't get my hands done or toes. And of course, barbershops are required to shut down. So I took the initiative on ordering some clippers and some other barber essentials. So I may be doing a cutting my hair for the first time. I'm in a house all year, so if I mess up, I mess up. It'll grow back. It's just hair. If I'm not posting for a while, or if you, if you see me for the next videos wearing hats or um, durags, that's why, because I messed my hair up. So don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel and turn on your post notifications so you get notified when I upload my next video. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at PayWithJays and tweet me, also PayWithJays. Until next time, peace, pay gang. And make, no, before I say peace, Make sure y'all out there staying safe from this coronavirus because Corona let's say the virus is not playing with y'all, all right? Stop going outside, practice social distancing so this whole thing can go away because I want to go to school. I am so tired of staying home and practicing social distancing. I'm ready to go outside, okay? So do what y'all got to do so Corona can go away. Miss Rona is getting on my nerves, okay? All right, y'all feel me? You see me? All right, peace, big <laughs>